don't take away nights How many miles did we burn Just to see a little of the world How many times did we say we'll forever Hi everyone and welcome to it. Welcome back to another weekly vlog with me. Hope you're ready to hang out with me for the next however many minutes. Today we are starting off on Monday. I, obviously it's a weekly vlog. And today I'm doing a little day in my life on my Instagram story. So this is your sign if you don't follow me on Instagram to follow me over there because I am doing a fun little day in my life. I'll show you so far what I have. I have this little selfie with my to-do list for the day, going through everything. And then once I did my first thing, I put it on there and checked it off. And I'm basically just gonna do that all day. I'm just going to go through tasks and share after I've done them. So that's what I'm doing today. But I'm only doing that because I have a lot I'm doing today, obviously. So it's more interesting because not every day is interesting enough to put on my Instagram story. So that's really fun. I was answering some emails and now I have a lot of filming to do today. It's a big, big filming day. So I'm going to do now a little TikTok. It's like a UGC, which is user generated content. So I am making it for this Brand and they're just gonna use it on their own social media. I don't have to post it, which is kind of interesting. Um, and then I have some Instagram stories to film for a sponsorship. And then a Zoom call with my manager. And then I'm going to film a YouTube video, sit down about my aura ring. So that's the plan for today on Monday. We actually have a little bit of a busier week ahead. So saddle up and get ready to be productive together this week. <laughs> oh yeah, also if you're new here, welcome. I'm so happy you clicked on this video and you're here. I'm Julia, I am 24 years old. I live in Indiana and I do content creation full-time but I also have my own little business where I do wedding videos and wedding content creator stuff so that's a lowdown on me if you are excited to be here and want to stick around so today is obviously a pretty big work from home day but you guys I have a new co-worker starting this week so oh my gosh <laughs> crazy shocking information um, my husband uh, he is working from home starting today and he's basically going to be studying for a bunch of licensing exams because he's going to be a financial advisor someday but he is doing that all from home on like this program that they have for him so that means I have a new co-worker but that also means I need to not bother him throughout the day because obviously we would both be working from home and I do a lot of filming and talking to you guys which is very distracting so that means I'm out of my office. It forces me to come out here and use it and be productive out here since he's in there being productive. It makes me feel like I need to really be doing stuff. <laughs> so yeah, that's how the new random life change is going. I'm excited to see how it goes throughout the week. Yeah, let's go ahead and start filming some content. <laughs> I love the way it writes. I feel like I have such better control of what I'm writing. I have to say overall my favorite thing about this rock paper pencil protector. Okay, I have been getting some work done. I just finished filming one of the sponsorships for the day and now I'm about to go inside on a little bit of a lunch break, film another sponsorship, and then we'll get back to work also planning out the YouTube video. So I've been seeing all these really cute videos of people making their coffee for the day when they sit down to like work from home or something. They like pour the coffee over their milk while they're at their desk. So I wanted to make a video like that, but it took a lot to make that happen since my office is detached. I can't just walk from one room to another with two cups, one with coffee and one with just the milk and ice. So I had to like bring it all out on my MacBook like this and it was so funny, but it worked. Check out my Instagram and TikTok probably for the post. <laughs> What is it? Tuesday? Yeah, Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. I'm currently sitting outside of a gym. This is frightening. I don't work out. So I'm going to a cycling class because a friend asked if I'd join her. So we're gonna see how it goes. Wish me good luck. We'll see. Okay, we got this little blueberry bagel. 
of the strawberry shortcake latte. What do you have, Hannah? Uh class we went and got coffee and then she's actually getting married next year so we talked a little bit about her wedding and helping plan that um and then afterwards i came and i picked up kylie and we went to costco so i got a smoothie from costco and then we got dog food and all sorts of other stuff so that was a great trip and now i'm heading home because i have some videos to edit so let's go back and do that <laughs> If you guys can't tell, I am tagging along with my sisters while they are back to school shopping this year, just for fun. Then we're gonna go get dinner afterwards. The stuff here this year is so cute. This is always one of the sad parts of being graduated already is not getting to shop for all the fun supplies anymore, but it's still all really cute. These are adorable. Oh my gosh. Okay, I might have to get one of these. That's only, that's really not bad of a price for a cute little thing. Wait, this whole section is cute. They have a little organizer, cord wallet. All these different cord straps. Oh, that is awesome. So fun, what the heck? All right, we finished shopping and now we're going to get dinner at Flat Top Grill. Emily's here with us. Oh, you got a new phone case. It's yeah. really cute, is that so much? Yep. Thanks. <laughs> so I don't know if I can. <laughs> Hi guys, happy Wednesday. I've been slacking on the vlog, I'm so sorry. My SD card ran out of storage, but I just cleared some up and then it's Prime Day, so I did order a few extras, which is great. But we're back in business, we have some space to vlog now. I'm currently out at a coffee shop, if you can't tell. It's a little loud in here. It's a new one that's kind of opened up near me, so it's really cute. It's like bee themed, hive themed, adorable. But I'm just doing some editing and I actually have a friend here from town who is doing some work. She does social media also, so we are just having a work from home day. This is Shay. Hey, hate of the vlog. We're having a co-worker day. Yeah, we're having a co-working day. We are co-workers now. Yes, we are co-workers. It's amazing. So I am doing some editing. I have a whole list. I'll show you. Okay, here's my little list. It's a lot of random small things, so if you're actually reading it, don't judge for the stuff I put on here. <laughs> I just have to keep it in here or else I'll forget about it and get mad when I don't do it. So that's my thing for the day. And I am currently working on some edits for a YouTube video that's going to be posted. And yeah, we're just having a great time. Maybe I was blind, known you forever while I tried to find someone that could be my great love. Right in front of me, I didn't realize you were my dream. Hi everyone, happy Thursday. Today I have a little bit of a busy day at home. I did get to sleep in a little because thankfully I have my YouTube videos done for this whole week already done, scheduled and uploaded and approved and ready to go. So I am just having so much fun now the rest of the week. Stress free, except today, right now I'm about to go into town and shoot some photos for one of my clients that I have for Julie Kate Creative Studio. I run their Instagram, so I am going and just taking a bunch of photos. I had to paint my nails real fast so that I could be able to take pictures with rings on. Um, um, so doing that and then grabbing lunch for Keegan and I and then coming back home and then we need to shoot some photos for a sponsorship and then a bunch of other small tasks and then we're going out to dinner tonight and then going to drinks with friends so it's gonna be a great day that ice machine is so loud it drives me crazy um but anyways I have this top and these pants extra from Princess Polly I think this necklace I get a lot of questions about I made it with a bunch of stuff off of Amazon I'll have to try and get the links for that it was all from Kylie so I'll have to ask her but yeah all right we need to go <laughs> I'm currently out of my office. I went into the store and shot those photos. I actually spent like an hour making a reel about the different wedding rings for different Taylor Swift eras. So that was fun, but it took me forever. Anyways, I had to come back out into my office and take some photos and film some reels for a Walmart post that I'm doing. And the stuff is actually really cute. This is this video is not sponsored by them, but I am obsessed. These little things are so cute and they work so well in my office. They match my chair. This I'm gonna put out in my desk setup in Keegan's office. Love a good Polaroid. 
But then this Keurig, I'm gonna keep out here and make it a little coffee bar section. I think over here on this bookshelf. Sorry, I was, I, this becomes a mess. <laughs> Always becomes a mess whenever I'm filming stuff. But right now, it's kinda cute in here because I have these disco balls right here in the sun. So I think it's projecting onto the ceiling and making everything it's so cute. Um, but anyways, just got the work done for the day. Now I probably should go in and edit that stuff and send it in. But while we're out here working on work stuff, I needed to make some edits to my website. And that brings us into today's sponsor of the video, which is Squarespace. I host both my websites for my business as my personal brand, juliakchris.com, and my wedding vendor service that I do now, Julia K Creative Studios on Squarespace. So this is perfect. Obviously I know and love them. And it's really cool because now they've made it very easy for you to create your own website with the new Squarespace blueprint. You can choose from a professionally curated layout or you can build your own website from the ground up. And then they can also help with some optimized SEO tools and just so much for you to easily make a personalized website. If you're wanting to sell products, you can easily do that on your website. You could sell digital goods, physical goods, services like coaching services just anything on Squarespace so that's really nice and then on top of that if you work with clients you can also manage invoices and stuff related to that on Squarespace to just make everything one customized streamlined workflow which is great here's a little look at the websites that I've created with Squarespace again so easy I've been able to do it easily each time so if you guys are interested you can head to squarespace.com for a free trial and then when you're ready to launch you go to squarespace.com slash Julia Chris to save 10% off of your first purchase of a website or domain so easy amazing everything's also down in the description too yeah I am just finishing up a few last things on my to-do list for the day this background looks so cute right now I'm obsessed then in a few hours we're going to be meeting up with some friends and we have a girl who was a foreign exchange student when I was in high school she's back visiting so we're going to go meet up with her and that'll be a good time so I need to go and get a move on with my to-do list though before then <laughs> there because we're going to go shopping. We go up to these outlets in Michigan City, Indiana each summer usually and we just go shopping a little bit. I don't really need anything today but I'm just going to tag along and look around because I spent way too much money on Prime Day this week so I need to not spend anything today. I'm just going for the fun of it. We will see. I don't know I say that but I'll probably end up buying stuff. We'll see. I'll show you a haul at the end of the day I'm sure. But yeah so that's the plan. I'm listening to What We Said podcast and just making the drive up there. Okay, now that we're not in a moving car and I'm not driving, um, we just made it to the lake house. So let's go in and see what everyone's up to. Many eyes wonder if our goodbyes can be the sweet, yet we still cry. With all the wind goes our mistakes. Hello, everyone. So we're out shopping here with Emily and Sarah, and unfortunately today there's a random outage. Market Microsoft, I think. I don't know. I need to read into a little bit more, but every store we wanted to go to so far, like Nike and Vera Bradley, were the big ones that we always like to hit. They're down because they can't process any transactions because of whatever outage is going on. So um, we had like a three-hour trip total yeah. up here, and are maybe not even be able to go to the stores we wanted to. So. All right. H&M, no sign on the door. You can give it a shot. Every summer, every winter, or every season, I'll be missing. 
Okay. I cringed myself out. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> it's later in the day. Nike and Vera, everything ended up turning back on. Well, kind of. We had to pay cash at Vera Bradley, but it worked out. Then we just spent way too much Kate Spade. Got some purses. Emily already's rocking hers. So cute. Actually, this is my new one, too. I like them because they're wide enough to put my camera in. So whenever I'm on the go, I just can fit it in there, which is great. So... That's why I needed it, and my other one was disgusting, so it's time for a new one. But now we are heading back home, finally. <laughs> it's like 6 p.m. at home. We still have about three hours of driving. All right, it is haul time. Time has come. Um, today was particularly bad <laughs> for my bank account. So let's start off. Okay, first off, I'll show you everything that's from Hollister. And it's just tiered, very cute, because I'm going to be working tons of weddings coming up, and you need, like, outfits to wear. Some sleep shirts. This one is extra large, where it is, like, a dress almost, and it's just this cute ballerina pattern. Another sleep shirt. Oh my gosh, I love this. One more sleep shirt. Yep. They're just so soft. I'm excited. This is obviously very themed about comfy clothes, so I got these pants. They're, like, the wide leg sweatpants, and I'm also wearing some right now that I'm obsessed with, too, also from Hollister. These ones are so cute. They say San Diego, California. I love that place. Come on. It's where my best friends live. So had to get them. Okay. These nice two shirts were not on sale, but I had to get them. Adorable. Also adorable. $5 tank top. Okay. These shorts were $11. I found them on like a sale rack and obsessed. I needed some jean shorts that fit and like my butt wasn't hanging out of so those are perfect got this little swimsuit top i need to find the bottoms online somewhere oh plus pants i'm wearing right now where's the matching hoodie oh matching hoodie <laughs> the sweatpants i'm about to put this on as pajamas and read the rest of the night wild friday night i know i know i guess you don't need to be jealous <laughs> um, oh, one last thing from Hollister for me. This green striped sweater, because fall is coming and can never have enough sweaters. So that's everything for me, I think, from Hollister. I'll try and link as much as I can, but since it was all from outlet stores, I can't promise that I'll find the links to everything. Okay, then I actually got a lot of the good stuff for Keegan. So, oh, I got this hoodie for him from Hollister. Just everything is so soft. So that and then some sweats for him. Then. I am obsessed with these pants. They're so cool. They're almost like a cargo pant from Nike though. And they look so good on. I mean, I'm trying on. <laughs> and they fit, perfect. So these are really cool. Then he needed some new work pants. So we got some of these cool golf pants from Nike. So we went to the Nike outlet, obviously. So there's some black ones. And then, oh my gosh, I love these. There's like this like bone color, these shorts. <laughs> okay, and then everything golf was an additional 20% off. So I got him some shirts. I love this one. Cute. There's the logo there, but then it also has the logo on the back shoulder. So kind of fun. Cute color. Hat. It also says Nike right there. A belt. So that's the Keegan haul. I did get stuff for Lauren K. Koa's baby. Yeah, it's okay if she sees this. Lauren, got you guys this cute little bunny. Don't think you're kidding me. The little bows. I'm obsessed, obsessed. And then this little sweater, so cute, so cute. So I have a few other things I need to pack up and mail over to them before baby comes. Then my last thing, oh man, I got this new purse. I love, I have a white Kate Spade purse that I got a few years ago and it's literally disgusting. I've gotten coffee and Coke spilled all over and it's stained. So it was time that I got a little upgrade from that one. So I'm able to fit my vlog camera that I'm vlogging on in here whenever I'm on the go. So that's why I really like this purse. Was not planning on buying anything at all from Kate Spade, but had to get it. So cute. It's like, oh, well, I'm already upgrading my purse. Might as well. I've got my wallet too. The one I have, I literally have this exact wallet in black from Kate Spade from years ago. I think like high school, honestly. I think 2019. That one, the zipper was broken and everything. So it was, it was time. She needs retired. But I got this really pretty pink. It's adorable. I got a few things in on Amazon Prime Day that I ordered. Got some new mascara. Got this curling iron that's supposed to be a dupe for a expensive, it's like the bioionic curler. So I really want to learn how to do salon waves on myself and curl my hair like that. So I got it. So did my little sister Sarah. So we're both trying to teach ourselves. I got the 1.25. So I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to watch a few tutorials, but got that. It's only 20 bucks. Everything should be linked on my Amazon storefront. 
that I got for Prime Day. So if you see anything that you're interested in, it's on there. Oh, this is adorable. Okay, cute. So I'll try and have as much linked as I can below. Um, it's gonna take me a minute to search through everything and find it, but I will try my best. So I think I'm gonna shower, get in my new comfy set and do some reading and chill out. So I'll see you guys probably in the morning. <laughs> It is Saturday. Happy Saturday to everyone watching. I am currently in the middle of getting ready. I just kind of threw my hair up in a little, okay, this is dirty. Claw clip for now. I'm going to try and curl it later with my new curler, but I need to go run some errands first. So I am just at least have the makeup done for now. Of course, mascara all over my eyelids. Um, so I'm gonna go to the grocery store and then I'm going to go out to my grandparents' house and pick up a thing of some weed killer because the weeds out at our fire pit are awful. So we're going to do that. Then get back here real fast to curl my hair because we're going to a little festival concert tonight. So we gotta get ready for that. <laughs> okay, I am trying out Brooklyn and Bailey's skincare brand. I've never tried anything, so I'm excited. I don't know, I'm getting desperate with my skin, so we're gonna give it a shot. <laughs> okay, shopping trip was a success. I think I got everything I needed. Hopefully I did, I don't know, we'll see. Um, As I was walking out, there's a man over there, like he has flowers and a ball jar and he wrote, I all I read was I love you. He's like on his phone looking up a video on how to arrange the flowers into the jar and I just thought that was the sweetest thing I've ever seen. So cute. Um, But now it's time to go back and I'm not gonna have much time to curl my hair before this little concert that we're going to so that's sad but that means i really need to get a move on so let's go back home Sunday. I am all dressed and ready. We are going to go to Fort Wayne and get some lunch. We're gonna hopefully get Panda Express. We stop into Bath and Body Works and maybe get some new wallflower scent refills. And then, oh, Best Buy. Keegan needs to get something for his little computer thingy that they're building today. So that's the plan right now for today. It's already one o'clock. We let ourselves sleep in today. Ah! Sorry, there was a nap. That's a fly into my coffee. I hate when that happens because then that's just disgusting. I have to make a whole new one. So, anyways, we slept in today. It was great. And now I like sleeping in, but I just feel very off right now. So, hopefully, when we get back from Fort Wayne, I can do a little bit of reset because this house is disgusting. Okay, it's not that bad, but there's all of our shopping, which we've done to ourselves. But you can see everything over there. There's trash everywhere. We need to sweep the floors. And we have like 20, not 20. I think like four or five loads of laundry that need put away, so that we've got some work to do. But I used my new skincare stuff that I got yesterday for the first time this morning, so I'm feeling great about that. And I got some pimple patches. I literally have one on right now. You can literally see it, but I don't care. I had them on last night while I went to bed, and then I woke up in the middle of the night and had to walk Apollo, and I didn't realize how much I just like touched my face out of habit to just squeeze or pick off skin. I don't even know. But within like the few times that I woke up to walk Apollo, I kept squeezing my face. I was like, oh my gosh, because then there was a patch on it. So I realized how often that I actually pick my face. So I read on the package that you can also wear them just during the day to prevent picking. So I'm going to try it and see what happens. I really need to get my face in check. So trying something new. But I need to put my lid on my amber mug. I love this thing. A smart mug. It's temperature controlled, so it'll stay hot for a few hours. So while we're gone and out and about, I can shrink this. So, yeah. Okay. Let's have ourselves a great Sunday. Oh, Daisy Kiku. Daisy Kiku. Wait till you go next, huh? Excuse me. Oh, Daisy Kiku girl. Hi, the CP girl. Can I do more? Get back here, we're not done. Hi, Mr. Toby in second. Oh, these are looking good. You just got yours done. Yes, you got yours done last week. Come here, Lynn. Come here. 
Come here. Should I just build myself a PC? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> are we going to buy the body works or we can also go? We can go to Bath and Body Works. It's not like we're rushing for you. Putting that in. Good. <laughs> It like 20 times today. So right now I'm currently in migraine mode if you're wondering. I, I, I'm trying to vlog here, Lynn. Anyways, I put a tank top on because something that helps me whenever I have a migraine is I use Icy Hot, which is like <laughs> cooling gel that you put on. It gets like cold and then hot, so Icy Hot. Um, anyway, so I put that on and I don't like it when it gets on my shirts because I don't really love the smell. So I try to wear something that I don't get it on. Then my hair up. And then I always put a headband on also so that my little baby hairs don't fall out and get in it either. So, excuse my migraine outfit. <laughs> Anyways, I'm about to start making dinner. We're having Doritos chicken casserole tonight. It's actually so good. I always make this whenever we have people over just because it's really easy and everyone usually likes it. So, making it. I took my migraine medicine, so I'm just waiting for it to go away. So hopefully it will before people come over. But yeah, we're having a chill Sunday evening. I have my ambiance going on the TV. We have low lights everywhere, candles are lit, and it's just a great Sunday. I really wanna read later tonight. I kinda wanna finish my book. I've been reading Nightbane. It's the second book to the Light Lark series. I don't know, I've been actually really bored with it so far. It's starting to pick up a little bit, but I don't know, I haven't been loving it, but I am the kind of person where I can't really get enough of a book. I have to finish a book just to know what happens and to be able to check it off as completed, obviously. So I'm going to finish. I think I said I have like two hours left, so maybe tonight, I don't know. But yeah, all right, let's make some Doritos chicken casserole. Hey, Keegan. Keegan, come here. Waiting around. Is somebody here? Welcome. Excuse me. Gross tomatoes. Apparently you have them. Why is it the one? Why are you doing it? 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 What you have against me The city is not The place for us to be Cause I'm trying to figure out Why you hate me Was it something I did? Yeah, I don't need to Hey guys, it's actually the following week, so I'm about to start my next vlog, but I wanted to quickly just wrap up this vlog. And it was a chill day. We ended up having friends over for dinner, like I said, and it was awesome. We tried to build Keegan's PC, but things have gone wrong. So unfortunately, no other updates on that right now. I need to maybe take it somewhere. I don't know. And then the next morning, I woke up early and I went and took Sarah's senior photos. So that will be coming up in the next weekly vlog. So make sure you subscribe and stick around for that or follow me on Instagram for behind the scenes updates because I always post stuff in real time over there on Instagram. But I think this is where we're going to wrap up this weekly vlog. Thank you guys again so much for coming along my life and caring enough to watch, especially to this point. So if you've made it to this point, comment this emoji right here. So now who all made it to the end because I love you guys and you're amazing. But with that, I need to film a video and get started on the next weekly vlog. So I'll see you guys on Thursday with my next video. Bye! For you to call back.